Today we will look at the symptoms, effects, and emotional damage mono can take on a person. We will also examine the solutions. Meet Billy. Billy isn't feeling very well. What's wrong, Billy? I feel like I have a fever ranging from 101 Fahrenheit to 104 Fahrenheit. I feel like I have a headache and I have a pain in the upper left part of my abdomen. Billy has just described some of the symptoms of Epstein-Barr virus, or EBV. EBV is also known as mononucleosis, or mono, the kissing disease. Billy, break Billy. Sorry, Mom. Billy has lost his appetite, another symptom of mononucleosis. He's also lost energy. Billy is falling victim to EBV more with every minute. You see, EBV lives and grows in your nose and throat. Any fluid that comes from these parts of the body, including saliva, tears, or mucus, can be infected with the virus. The virus is spread when people come into contact with infected fluid. Meet Gertrude, Billy's female companion. She doesn't know it, but she is the one responsible for EBV. The interesting thing is, she doesn't know she has it. Some people have EBV and never experience the symptoms. They can still pass on the virus and infect others. The most common method of receiving the virus is intimate contact, or sharing saliva. In this case, though, Billy received the virus by sharing a soda pop after school with Gertrude. Billy has gone home now. He realized school was too stressful. The treatment for EBV is easy to follow. Get plenty of rest. Gargle with salt water, or use throat lozenges to soothe your th sore throat. And of course, avoid contact sports and heavy lifting to reduce the risk of injuring your spleen. Most people recover from EBV without other treatment after several weeks. For some though, like Billy here, it can take several months to fully regain their normal energy levels. Drink on, Billy. You've conquered EBV. Thank you.